If you are looking for some family friendly fun this weekend, you might want to head to the Franklin Institute. Yeah, this is really cool. A new cosmic exhibit called Wondrous Space opens tomorrow. And Action News reporter Corey Davis is live at the Franklin Institute for us this morning with a sneak peek. Hey, Corey. Hey, Aliana, Alicia, good morning. Yeah, they're putting the final touches on the exhibit. The, the uh, banners are already up outside of the Franklin Institute here, showcasing uh, the Wonder Space exhibit opening officially tomorrow. But wait until you see inside. We just got a sneak peek. Take a look at this. The massive Mars globe is the centerpiece of the Wonder Space exhibit, immediately igniting curiosity about space and beyond. This is the first of six permanent exhibits to open over the next few years, twice as large as others in the past. There are two levels to this. The first is a dark and ominous level like space and interactive activities that focus on teaching visitors of all ages about the elements of space beyond just black holes and galaxies. The second floor is all about the inspiration of what it'll take to bring people back to the moon and eventually to Mars. There are rockets, rovers, and displays of spacesuits. And I just spoke with Derek Pitts, the Franklin Institute's chief astronomer. He's been with them for 45 years and he works closely with NASA. He wants kids to know that they can also be part of the future of space exploration. I want kids coming through the exhibit to see someone that looks like them doing this really great and fun work and imagine themselves doing that in some of the careers that they see as part of the exhibit. Okay. Yeah, I used to want to be an astronaut. Then I got interested into aerospace engineering, oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> space yeah, shuttles, yeah, but yeah. those are no longer around. Right, right. <laughs> but now there are new rockets and there are other rockets that are coming, coming, coming in to take the place of space shuttle. And we want kids to realize that there's a spot for them. Yeah, there's plenty of space for everyone. So the Wondrous Space Exhibit officially celebrates the grand opening tomorrow and Sunday, 930 to 5 o'clock. Uh, tickets go on sale tomorrow. And the first 250 guests to arrive on Saturday and Sunday will get free space shuttles just like this one. Reporting live here in Center City, Corey Davis, Channel 6 Action News. Ooh, I love a little takeaway. That's yeah, cute. It's like a lot of fun. For the whole family. Thanks, Thank you, Corey. Corey. <laughs>